Stop. Hello everyone, this is David from goldstartool.com and uh, today I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you, even though we had a uh, video on uh, sewing machine motors, but today I'm gonna do one on a brushless uh, motor, uh, made by Nutec, electronic servo motor, but this one is brushless. Now, I don't know why it didn't say brushless, but this is a brushless one. 110 volt, 600 watts. Uh, that's why you have the 600W here. And it's the RPM up to 4,500. Uh, it's a very, very, very good machine, and uh, I'm gonna tell you why you need one of these if you're doing a uh, sewing machine and what is the difference between this one and a regular servo motor. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna be surprised that you are. I'm gonna open this. This is the box. Okay. So, uh, what comes inside the box? Oh. I feel like I'm doing one of those uh, toy YouTubes that they do. I mean, these people go buy you two toys and... Okay, so, this is the box. We're gonna get rid of the box. Uh, we got a ball joint. I'm sure your machine had one if you wanna change the motor. Uh, but, you get one of these. It's... Uh, Universal, you could use it on any type of sewing machine, industrial sewing machine. This is from the pedal to the uh, to the motor. So you're gonna get a very small, tiny motor. Uh, all right. And, I'm gonna open the other box. It's a um, control box. And I'm gonna go over every single one of these. Excuse the mess. Okay, now, first of all, why a brushless motor and not a servo motor? Both are quiet, both are servo, both are very, very uh, good with electricity, you save a lot of electricity. Um, but brushless doesn't have a brush, so you don't have to keep changing the brush. Those brushes, those like black brushes, like uh, charcoal thingies. Uh, these are brushless, it's more expensive, uh, but it's worth the money, I think, to go with this. Uh, with brushless, you have a, I mean, with the servo motor, you just have a volume that you could change the speed and uh, change the direction. But with this one, you have this. So we, before we get there, I'm gonna tell you, if you have a, any clutch motor, you don't have to worry about the bracket, would it fit your machine? They're all standards, and as you see here, this goes right where your old, big old 50 pound clutch motor would go. Huge, those are huge, but this is, very easy, you don't even need to use this kit here. This is a kit that has um, all the uh, accessories to attach this to your table. You could even use the one from your old sewing machine. But if you want, here it is one. Uh, for adjusting, if you want it higher and lower, these are all uh, the screws, the washers, the fasteners for the uh, wiring, and you get a uh, belt cover to cover your belt. And so this is that one, this is the part of the, uh, and this is 110 volt, you could use this in your home, in your garage, in place of work, no worries, this is not 22 volt. And then you get this one. Uh, this is a control unit with, uh, if you could see, you go, you know, attach it to your table like this, uh, from Nutec, and it tells you the motor size and everything. And here, with all, what, what are these four these digits? It will help you with the, that's where you count one of these things. Direction, speed. Um, now, I'm gonna get to the needle position part of it too. One more thing that you should know, that you see all, you have all this here, uh, with servo motor, you don't have all of these. 
with seven more you have only the uh, the plug for light LED lamp right here but you don't have this all of these are for different type of stuff what is it for for needle positioning if you need to put needle position if you want to buy from gold star tool one of these things that would adjust I mean you could do the needle positioning up or down if you could look closely right here this is actually the one that you use with this machine uh, now you could have any type of uh, needle positioning unit you could buy it from anybody but would still if you could see that in the back there are different type of uh, plug-ins adapters that comes when you buy one of these which is the needle position it comes with a different uh, let me just take this out and show you so when you buy one of these it will come like this and you have different type of uh, attachments for the motor so you could have if your motor like this one takes this for see easy easy okay but if you don't have that then your um, your needle positioning uh, the needle positioning system comes with, with different type of adapter to attach it to the uh, brushless motor so one of the reasons you need brushless motor is because you could use um, needle positioning system for needle up or needle down as you see here so the machine comes the motor comes with one of these um, so the direction how to use this you could adjust the speed from right here uh, backwards forward uh, reverse or forward the speed from right here again needle positioning from here and on top of that there is a bonus that comes with this that uh, with our machine you get LED lamp too well you cannot call it a lamp it's one two three four five six LED lamps that has a magnetic in the back that could stick if you could follow me that way and stick right here you see sticks right there and you could um, use this to the uh, plug it into the back of the motor right here with this one it goes right back here so so to just make it easy you got the ball done you got the tool to put on the uh, motor on uh, you got you get a bonus LED light okay one two three four five six one which is magnetic okay you get this paperwork that tells you uh, in both English and obviously Chinese uh, tell you how to uh, use the machine and in the back is very easy uh, the connections are all there you just go ahead and plug it in and this one and this is the plug 110 volt and um, see very easy there is no not a lot of uh, and you're not gonna make a mistake I might but you won't I promise you so you won't make any any mistakes plug it in and this one goes to and you know what I'm gonna just plug it in let's you know I'm gonna tell you how easy it is to it shouldn't take more than 10-15 uh, minutes and let me tell you something let me tell you something you're gonna save a lot of uh, uh, electricity and you're gonna save uh, and you're gonna you know your ears just these clutch motors are so heavy and they just keep running and running and running and running so these are very light and very quiet. Oh, I was gonna show you this. Oh, okay, here we go. Ta -da. And it's pretty good. Don't you think, Jasmine? I believe so, yes. Right, here we go. That's it. So, um, very easy. That's how quiet your motor is gonna be. And right here, it tells you, when I turn it on, it tells you what speed is on. 3,000. We could almost double that. 
Just go up and down. See? Oh, I gotta go down to make it to 45. And now, off. Let me just wait. You see how fast? So from right here, position, direction, and um, LED lamp right here. Lightweight, half a pound, and this one could be not more than three or four pounds right here. Easy, you should all get one of these. Uh, anybody that works with one of these industrial sewing machine, either being overlock, single needle, zigzag, whatever it is, you gotta have one of these uh, motors. Uh, save you time, save you money, and save you energy. Uh, thank you for watching. This is another video from goldstartool.com. Like, follow, and share. Thank you so much for watching. watching. This is our website, goldstartool.com.